Talent is harder because of the great talent vacuum cleaner that's Google and talent vacuum cleaner that's, that's Facebook. And what I've seen successful companies do now, they do a couple of things. One, even if they're, still, even if they're based in the Valley, they say, we're going to do distributed development and we're going to have small groups outside the Bay Area. We're going to find people in Portland and in Austin and in Seattle and in New York and Boston, and we're going to set ourselves up to work in that fashion because you can find people in those areas uh, more easily. Uh, they're less expensive. There's somewhat more of a burden if you're doing distributed development, but so many people, as long as it's not too many time zones away, so many people are now doing that successfully that I don't see that as a barrier. Yeah. And so that's, you know, that's, that's, that's one way. Another way, actually, in all honesty, is to locate up in the city. Because if you're down in the valley, it's like ground zero. Up in the city, there are a lot of developers and other people who don't want to make the commute down here. Right. Where they live in the East Bay and they want to take BART. I mean, I swear, if I stand on the roof of my building, which is on Howard Street, between 1st and 2nd, and I shout really loud, there have to be 200 other startups in the, within the sound of my voice. <laughs>